There was a morning collision at the railway station in Greater Noida and UP in uh, Gorakhdam Express rammed into a bus and got derailed. We have uh, we have Minakshi reporting on the story and with us on the phone line. Minakshi, uh, give us a little, uh, you know, give us some more details. Tell us a little bit about uh, the state of the people who've been injured and what's really uh, what's really underway at this point. Well, a major tragedy was averted here. There was an early morning collision, 5.30 in the morning, when uh, a, a super fast express uh, rammed into a bus which was trying to cross over. As you can see here, there are some remnants of the bus that remain. And uh, it was a major tragedy which was averted. What we are learning at this point in time, that there is only one person who has sustained injuries and he has been taken to the hospital uh, for treatment. As a matter of fact, I am joined here uh, by a senior railway official from uh, North Northern Central Railway, Mr. Anand Kumar, who reached the spot to uh, assess the situation. Let's go across to him for his first comments. Sir, what have you assessed so far? What uh, was really the occurrence? Can you give us some details that you've gathered? Well, I have just lent it here. I'm trying to gather the facts. But what I am told that the bus got stuck on the up line because it exhausted its CNG and the fellow are trying to push it. And since train was coming at a high speed, so it just dashed and dragged the vehicle and our gateman also got injured because of the flying part of the bus that's what I have come to know so far I have yet to gather all the facts uh, to ascertain the exact cause Sir, uh, was the gate open really so that the bus, I mean it crossed over and it was standing here at uh, the, the, the railway tracks when the ra rail uh, was coming and crossing over the bus was in position here so was there some kind of, a, uh, I mean the, the gates were they open for the bus to have entered? Well, I do not know really, but logically it appears that gate must have been opened that how the bus was inside and standing on the track. Uh, what has your assessment revealed so far, sir? What facts have you really gathered? Uh, what what uh, You just described to us the sequence of events. But besides that, uh, anything else that you have been able to ascertain? Well, I have come to know that a lot of traffic has been diverted via this level crossing, which otherwise not so busy because a major gate at Dunkor where some work is going on has been closed for traffic and heavy vehicular traffic is now flowing through this gate. So a lot of traffic is there on this gate. So a major tragedy averted, sir, would you say? I mean, it's a big relief that uh, one person, uh, hopefully he will uh, recuperate fast, but he's yes. uh, sustained injuries. You're saying your gatekeeper, he's been rushed to the hospital. But a major uh, tragedy averted? Yeah, in a sense, a major tragedy has been averted because had passengers been inside the bus, then it would have been a really a major tragedy because now bus driver and conductor could see the approaching train they just left the bus so there you have it, uh, the first-hand account of uh, the incident uh, that happened here early morning. Uh, uh, the railway official also laying it out for us, the facts that he has been able to ascertain so far and reiterating that it could have been a major uh, tragedy, but uh, it has been averted. And so far the news from here is uh, the, the gatekeeper of this crossing has sustained injuries and he's being treated at a local hospital here. Back